welcome back. Today we're on the road. We're northbound. The St. Paul, Minnesota. Street Machine Nationals, baby. I couldn't drive both of them, but I'm bringing both of them. Hell yeah. So let's go. Well, we made it to stage one, and that's where we're staying. It's about, I don't know, an hour northwest of where we live. Now I'm going to get the rat rod unloaded. The wife's going to jump in the Nova. And we're going to cruise to the state fairgrounds. Hell yeah. I think we're about ready to go here. I mean, we're only about three hairs past the freckle late, but whatever, we'll get there. Oh, 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 so ready for this. So ready. How's it going, you ask? Well, we made it to here and the rat rod overheated. Found out my fan wasn't working, blew a fuse, then blew three more fuses trying to figure out why the fuse blew. So now I've took my kicked my wife out of the Nova and I'm gonna go to the parts store and she's gonna sit here with the rat rod. So yeah, this is going perfect. No, it's not. $75 later at the local O'Reilly's, we're on our way back to the car. Hopefully we got everything we need. All right, we're back in her. Man's working. She's cooled off down to less than 200, so we're doing pretty good. There's my Nova. I'll just have to keep an eye on it and see what's going on with the fan. No, no, I didn't wire a relay in. Yes, yes, I know I should have wired a relay in. I don't know if that was the problem or not. We'll keep an eye on it. Well, folks, we made her in. Still not overheating, Nova's in tow. Now I just gotta get my registration packet, get in the show, find somewhere to hide in the shade, because it's like 90 degrees already. And we'll look at some cars, hell yeah. So excited. Ooh. Oh, I like that idea. Yeah. Yeah. See how he did his plug wires? Yeah. Gotta hold it like this, not like this. <laughs> and you can do it like that. Yeah. You gotta do slow movements. Yeah, oh, yeah, he's got wheelie bars. <laughs> this is a little Isn't that cool? Oh, Don't see them very often. Do you? That's what they do all weekend long, just cruise. Around the whole fairgrounds. Cars and cars and cars of all kinds. Oh, look at that. It's Yoda. Sutrand Van, cool Jeep. All sorts of cool stuff at this show. Here's a Mini Cooper. Ain't gonna lie, kind of want to take one of these. Rip all that stuff out of there and stuff a big block in there with really poking out of the hood. Yeah, that'd be kick ass. Cars, trucks, everything. You name it, they got it here. Oh, the old Pala SS. Oh, that thing's pretty clean. Slapping, as the young kids would say. Oh yeah, wife gets distracted by the Mustang. <laughs> Look at those kick-ass wheel tubs, LS swapped. Nice 63 C10, laying on the ground, exhaust through the fender. Nice little cubby back there, that's kind of clever. Whoever built this was way more skilled than me. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Boggers. Thing's probably got six grand worth of tires on it right now. Rubber ain't cheap. 
Nice truck, man. Thank you. Very nicely done. Oh, I like his shock mount. Sidewinder. Super clean interior. Huh? Oh, oh, oh. Poor fucking Ranger. That's awesome. Infamous. I mean, I respect it. I could never own something that nice, though. Oh, an old Laguna. My dad had one of those when I was a kid. Ooh. Stickers. That thing sounds healthy. Rock on, buddy. This thing is clean. Ooh, white for interior would never work for me. I would screw that up. I do like the color though. Oh yeah, Tin Man Customs. He makes some killer shit. That's a rat. I can follow him back. Do snack hitch, let him know the case. But that's a fuel tank, or what do you got going on? This thing's cool. Very, very cool. Hell yeah, tea bucket. Awesome color. Oh, it's for the sale, honey. Love the color. Rock on. Got a wooden bed. <laughs> oh, it's not interesting looking pinto. Oh, so cheap. That's pretty cool looking though. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting there. License plate four. I like it. Seat seems crooked to me, but maybe it's supposed to be that way. Redneck customs. Oh, it's all the way from Kentucky. Check this MGL. That's what I'm talking about. Small block Ford stuffed in there. My people. It's wild. Doors? No, T top doors. They're awesome. And it literally is radical. I've heard some stories about how this thing came to be, and it's pretty impressive. Look at the lines in this El Camino. Very talented. Very impressive. If you ever get a chance to check this thing out, you should. Ridiculous this thing is. Absolutely, and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. <laughs> this thing's awesome. Damn. Of course, Josh made it in his SX. He drives this thing everywhere. This thing gets all over the damn place. This Vegas is pretty sweet, too. Oh, there ain't a whole lot of room in the front of that thing for a radiator. Ah, the struggles of custom. It's worth it. Oh, 
Wow, this thing is sick. Very clean in there. Hot wheels. What's it look like on the inside? Oh, very nice. Look at this. Wow. On a way back. Or seats. On a way back. That's cool. Okay, so this is probably the most unique thing I've found so far. What is it, a Chevy Astro van or something similar? The gas tank is under the hood. Oh, they've mounted a motor out of a Lincoln in the back here to give it rear wheel drive. That's freaking awesome. That's cool. Ooh, I love me a Chevy Love. Ooh, E85 even. How eco-friendly. Nice square body. I don't think it's that douchey, but you know, whatever. Big block. Nice, all that swap. Laughing gas gasser. This thing is awesome. We've never seen it. I mean, look how clean this thing is. And she, she drives it. And this thing is amazing. The lady that owns it. I don't know her. I mean, the roof and everything. Super healthy sounding. 800 horsepower. I mean, down to the trunk detail. Subwoofer, everything. Yes, her gas. Awesome. Very cool. One of my favorites. Are these donks? I'm not uh, familiar with that community. I think I, I think they're they're, they're donk-like. I, I don't know. Camaro converted into a Trans Am. We are loaded up for day number two of Street Machine Nationals. We got at the gas station. Get some breakfast, some gas. We're running a little low on fuel for some reason. The wife's pulling out in the Nova right now. I'm pulling out in the rat rod. Let's go. Everybody is in staging. Gates don't open till eight o'clock. So everybody's just kind of hanging out and waiting. It's a way more condensed way to look at the cars, that's for sure. Yeah. They just keep piling in. Just lines of cars. Look at them all coming over, way over there. Just keep coming. Oh, it's gonna be a good day. We are here for day number two of Street Nationals. Cars are set up behind us, same spot as yesterday. By the free parking sign, of course, because I'm cheap. Got a couple guys up there polishing their Ford Ranger. Don't ask me why. Sitting back, relaxing, watching cars rolling. Like this nice Chevelle I just pulled in. That thing is sweet. We should build a car and do the Cannonball Rally. What the heck is a Cannonball Rally? I don't know. Something looks like fun to do. Oh, here comes a Mustang. Should we hide? It's beautiful out this morning. It's just a little mucky. Yeah, humid. Oh, what do we have coming here? Ooh, look at this coming out. That guy likes to go fast. Got the Twin City Mopar Club over there cleaning all their neons. They're probably darts, but they look like neons. Oh, this guy likes the party. Look at this thing coming.
Hi, please. Ah, it looks like a rock crawl. Oh, we've even got golf carts. Super high horsepower sleeper golf carts. Oh, look at this. This is a rock crawler. Trail rider. Got some of that Gilbert red dirt on there. Huh? Some Gilbert red dirt on there. Very nice. You know how that is to try and get it off. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's Punisher. The gates are open. More cars are filing in. Kids are climbing all over the rat rod. It's perfect. Beautiful out here today. Little T-tops. Love it. Look at them all just coming in. All different kinds of shapes, sizes, styles. No matter what you're into, you'll find it at this show. Well, that is a clean crew cab. Holy crap. I kind of want that. Nice. Now for a little walk about this thing, it sounds nasty. This is different. Things crazy. Probably the most radical side-by-side -side I've ever seen. Nuts. Someone's got a lot of time in this. Very clean. This Monte Carlo is clean, clean, clean. yours? Very nice. Oh, you can't see that TV because the big subwoofer's in the way. I got them in the door panels on all the doors. Oh, and in the visors. That thing's ridiculous. Wow. Cool wheel lights too. All kinds of different things here. Wowzers. People and cars as far as you can see. Everyone's just out enjoying the day in the sweltering heat. Every once in a while you come across a car that's just steaming a little warm. And there's lots of cooling puddles. Like right there. Somebody's overheating somewhere. And right there. Literally every direction you look, there's cars and people. 
jam packed into this place. Oh, look at this Impala. That is sweet. I like it. I'd never be able to keep it clean, but I like it. Very nicely done. Wow. What if we actually from Mexico? That is sweet. Wish I could find out who owned it. Very nice. This Firebird rocks. Oh, that's a rotary. Don't see many of them around here. That is rad. I don't know much about them though, so I'm not gonna say a whole lot. But it is cool looking. Still like that Firebird. Now this thing, I like that sticker. This thing is cool. Oh look, that's where the mail goes. This is awesome. Oh, he's fuming himself right out, so that works out good. Maybe that's how he lights his cigarettes. Oh, look at the back. Looks like he still has the eyeball in it even. Creepy, but cool. Where's the eyeball? Awesome. Father. He's got bones hanging off of it. Not those fake Halloween bones. He's got real bones. Or the fake head. And I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of jealous of the Pizza Hut delivery magnet on top. I kind of want that. There's a mailbox on it. This thing's fun. This thing's really fun. Awesome job, whoever did this. Oh, look at the red lights on that truck. <laughs> Evil eyes. This green one's nice. I like this green one. I like this square body, too. I like them all. Cool and hard in the back. I climbed up and then I climbed <laughs> this thing out. It's a ute. Steering wheel's even on the wrong side. It's awesome. God, I want this thing. I want this thing bad. I ain't got the money for it, though. Nope. This thing would be fun. tinted windows.
Freddy's claws. Not my cup of tea, but I can respect. It's just so little of ground. How does a guy like me even get in one of these things? Do you just kind of like fall and roll or what, what do you do? This thing's awesome. I love the name, The Blunder. Ooh, I like his throttle. Nicely done. With a wing. 440 six pack, four speed, super bad numbers matching, only $289,000. A little bit out of my price range Just by about $288,000. Looks nice though. This thing is freaking wicked. Saw it driving around earlier. I was trying to find where it was parked. I really want to build one of these. I think I've said that about 10 times today. I got a lot of cars on my build list. Damn it. Those aren't Hollies. What the, what, what the hell? It's got the super high vis wheels. So that way when you're broke down on the side of the road, people can see you. There can't be much of a cushion in that ride with no tire. <laughs> Remember when chameleon paint was all the rage? Oh, six two diesel on that one. All day long, just car after car after car. Best kind of car shows. If you wanted, you could just sit and watch the cars parade by you all day. We are packing up for day number two here at Street Machine National. I'm not sure what day number three is going to bring. Well, we'll go to another show tomorrow. I'll keep you posted. So for any of you that may be wondering about my overheating issues I've been struggling with, I think we have it dicked. Seriously this time. It is a legitimate 85 degrees out right now. And <laughs> thick. And I just took it down the highway for about 30 minutes drove through some residential areas. Uh, we didn't even get up to 200 degrees. So I'm gonna call that as a win. I'm gonna richen it up just a smidge more. Seems like if I get in the upper RPMs going down the highway, she still wants to warm up a little more than I'm happy with. And I think it's cause it's leaning out a little too much on the higher RPMs. A little air, air fiddling with the carbs that I probably shouldn't be doing in the first place, but I'm going to. And see if we can't bring that temperature down just a smidge more. But other than that, and some bump steer, I'm pretty happy with it. But tomorrow I'm going to Hastings. Hastings, historical car show. Well, it's a beautiful morning. It's already about, I don't know, 75, 80 degrees. And we are on our way to Hastings. Last two days of Street Nationals were a blast, but I love the Hastings cruising, so that's what we're heading to today. Put some more miles on the car, see some different cars. Go meet some more people, have some more fun. Hell yeah. I love driving this thing. This car is fun. We are coming into downtown Hastings. Look at that view. Always love this drive. The mighty Mississippi. Yeah. 
uh, let's get these things parked. Let's get the rat unloaded and drive that around a little bit. We're at the historic downtown Hastings car cruising. And it is packed. Everywhere. All the side streets, everything. All kinds of cool cars here. I love the quad headlights. I might steal that idea. <laughs> this guy's got custom wood interior. Look in there. We're doing good, taking off. Oh yeah. We're gonna go get something else. No, we're taking off. Not fair enough. Fun weekend, it's been hot out, you've been all over the place. Oh place. my god. Machine. How was it, Dud? Good, good. Hot though. Hot. I'm gonna go cool off in the pool. That's what's I'm gonna do that here in a little while, I think. Yeah, yeah. We'll see you, man. Have a good one. Take care. Never seen one. At first glance, I thought this thing was homemade. But it's a legit deal. Pretty cool. Never seen something like that. Never seen. I thought it was I thought it was homemade. Yeah. Wow. Before before doom buggies were even a thing. Yes, right. That's rad. This thing screams Americana, but it's German. Not really sure. Either way, it's cool. Yep. Eighteen ninety six horseless carriage. Well, I'm hot, I'm tired, it's been a long weekend, it's been a fun weekend. It's time to go home though. If you follow me on TikTok, you know that we locked our keys in the trunk of the Nova. Fellow Koga car guys gave me a screwdriver. We popped that tumbler out of there, and we we're good to go. Now we're on the road, heading home. Thanks for watching. I love the chase and the hunt, and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want, and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank, no, I'm funded. Play the game like it's nothing. I'm always thankful for something. Don't take for granted, stay humble. Now wake up. It's time to look at the enemy Look in the mirror if he is no friend of me It's not working out